sweet peas, Neela here, and welcome to uh, me answering your questions, basically. <laughs> um, I have 17 questions, I believe, that, got, that I got asked. So I'm going to read the questions from Twitter, since there's like only three on the, well, not three, but since there's, since there's like, there's three people who asked on, on Twitter, and then I'll jump into the YouTube um questions next i can't think <laughs> so um weeb our audios ask can we get coffee <laughs> of course we we can get coffee but not too much coffee i don't trust your caffeine <laughs> um um that underscore trash underscore mammal asked what are your favorite types of audios to listen to my favorite types of audios are i do enjoy the boyfriend audios and i also like the story audios with myth mythical creatures and everything like with the vampires werewolves or like the fairies or the nagas or the orcs or like anything that sounds like like D, D characters basically and like you go on adventures and everything those are those are my favorite um audios as well now second question from them would you consider making this a career not really this is really just a fun hobby of mine's just for me to do in my free time and so it would be nice if it could be a career but i'm not putting all my cards on the table for it but if someone a company or a corporation wanted me to be a voice actor for like a cartoon or anything that would be awesome but i'm not really betting on it so I guess I would love to have a career in this, but I'm not aiming to have a career in this. Another another question from them is, if you were a dog, what type would you be? I would be a lab. <laughs> I would be a brown lab, and it's because I love Labradoodles so much, and they're like just the best dogs ever. And if not a lab, I would be a Great Dane, because I love how they're, they're such tall, big boys and girls and there's like they're just such big dogs and i love them <laughs> and the final question from them is do you have any butter i do have butter so if you need some i'll glad you i will gladly give you some if you need some and they also say congrats on 1k and thank you so much for the congratulations okay and ash and gray smr which is funny because these are the questions that I asked him when on his on his 1K video. So how dare he? <laughs> but his first question is, do you keep it in the DMs? And the answer is yes. Sometimes I keep it in the DMs. <laughs> um, the next question is, what is your favorite thing to eat? Uh... My favorite thing to eat are carne asada fries. Like, I can eat those, like, three to four times a week which is really not healthy <laughs> but i just love those like i can eat those so, like all all the time which is not which is not healthy but i would totally eat those and the third question is do you have a favorite va if so who i don't necessarily have a favorite VA like i simp over a lot of VAs so i can't just have one i have to have all of them <laughs> so i don't have a favorite one but some of my favorites would be salad va new j va fangar uh shy guy va and it's loomis as well like those those people are like my one of my favorite vas that i get so excited when they have a new video out so for sure them the next question is, why are you such a nerd? <laughs> and it's just because I want to be a nerd. Like, being a nerd is great. <laughs> and the last question is, do you play D&D? &D? If so, what is your favorite character? I don't play D&D. &D. Like, I have a D&D &D character, but I don't play as much as I would like to play. I just don't have a party or I don't have a group of friends to play it a lot with because of what's going on and, like, of everyday life so i don't have 
a party to play. But I do play in D&D, but not as much, I should say. And my favorite character is, I have, my character that I did create for it is an elf. And she is my, she is my favorite character because she's my only character. <laughs> okay, now I'm going to go on to the, to the YouTube questions now. Okay, here, and these are the YouTube questions. So, Schooner Tuna, Schooner Tuna, Schooner Tuna, I apologize if I said that wrong. Um, they asked, what inspired you to be the, well, sorry, what inspired you to be voice actress um, what inspired me? I, I don't really know what inspired me. I just, I guess what inspired me to do it was just that I was just like, oh, I, this is so cool. I love VAs. And I just, I just wanted to give it a try, basically. Where smart, what inspired me to do it kind of is just like out of boredom and curiosity of trying to see if, if I could do it and if I would like, if I would like doing it. Uh, their other question is, who is your favorite voice actors and actress? I, I already <laughs> named a lot. <laughs> I already named all the ones I already simped, I simped over. Um, their last question is, what advice can you give aspiring VAs? Um, advice that I feel like every VA would probably say, and I agree, is just go for it. Like, if you have an idea or if you find a script that you really like and you want to give it a try, just go for it and see how you like it and everything. And also something else that I believe uh, Rich Audios, who I follow on Twitter, said. Like, they said that um, you don't need, like, you don't need money already. You don't need the most expensive microphone. You don't need the greatest software. Like, you don't to, like, start recording. Because I found out that a lot of the VA started recording on their phones and everything. Like, I, before I got, like, a Yeti and another really good microphone, I was just, I just bought the cheapest mic that I could find on Amazon and just started recording and stuff like that. So, just go for it and don't think you need, like, the best software or mics to make a good video. You you don't just, like, if you want to get a good mic and good software in the long run, that's great. But, like, to start off, you don't need all that. You ju You just need make sure you just need like a recording just make sure like you have like you can record and make sure you can upload it on youtube if that's all and that's all you need that's all you need for sure um luxus smr which is my uh lux my bro <laughs> he asks when can we drink together probably this weekend <laughs> maybe this weekend bro <laughs> we can drink together <laughs> um uh, just me still me asked what kind of smr videos do you like to listen to again um boyfriend audios and like D, D character audios for sure that goes on adventuring um pizza man i really love this <laughs> pizza man um asked how do you balance your work while also not affecting your personal life uh i granted i didn't really have a schedule uh videos i just for sure i wanted just to post twice a week and if i didn't just like once a week and how i would do that granted i'm only in school i don't work right now so and then on some days i have only one class oh, well for this semester on like on a few days i only have one class and so after that class i try to make sure i get all my homework and stuff done and then I start, um, if I have a script done, then I record it. And then like after I'm done recording, then I start on another script that I have. So it doesn't really affect me as much since I don't really do much in my personal life. I am a sad loner. <laughs> I don't have a personal life. But, but with schoolwork and everything, I just make sure that's done first on the days that I'm not busy. And then I start on the audios and in the script writing after I'm done. Um, I cannot pronounce this. I'm so sorry. Kugaski Nubata. I apologize. I don't, I cannot say that. Um, asked, do you like dogs or cats? I am a cat person. I do like dogs, but if, if I had to choose between a dog and a cat, it would be a cat. Like, 
hands down. I, I love cats so much. And then speaking of cats, a business cat asked, what is your favorite and least favorite Pop-Tart flavor? My favorite Pop-Tart flavor is 100% strawberry. It's, I love strawberry Pop-Tarts. Those are really good, especially when you toast them. The best, the best. And the least favorite Pop-Tarts, I believe are the brown sugar ones. I think that's what they're called. Like the brown sugar with marshmallow ones. Let, let me, let me, I gotta double check real quick. <laughs> yes, brown sugar cinnamon Pop-Tarts. I hate those. <laughs> those are really gross and well, they're not gross, but no, it's, it's, it did not, I did not like, like when I was a kid, I would try all the pop tarts, but when I got to the brown sugar ones, no, did not like it, wasn't a fan, hated it. And Dashaun Deva Davison, sorry, said, okay, serious question, what is two plus two? I hope it's four, because if it's not four, that explains why I, I have not been doing good in all my math class. <laughs> but, yeah. <laughs> but anyway, those are all the questions. So, yep, those are all the questions. Thank you so much for everyone for asking me questions. And thank you so much for the over 1K sweet peas. I really appreciate it. And I love all of you so much for supporting me. And giving me so much love and nice comments in um, in all the videos. I'm so happy that so many of you love the, the things that I've done and, and do. And it's just amazing. It's just really amazing. And I know a lot of VAs always say that they never think that um, they would get these, like, a lot of subscribers and everything like that and it's true once you do hit a milestone you just can't believe it you're just like stunned and everything and so that's how i feel i'm just stunned and i'm happy that i put myself out there and i'm so happy that i've met so many amazing people on this journey and i hope i meet some more amazing people as i continue so thank you so much everyone for listening i will probably post this on friday hopefully maybe <laughs> i'll probably yeah i'll post this on friday and then yeah <laughs> sorry i don't know how to end things but anyway th again thank you so much i love you all i hope you guys are being safe and i'll catch you in the next video bye